Hey guys, so today I want to do a quick little video here telling you how you can get the latest iOS 7.1 Beta 3 installed on your device if you're interested in that. Um, so um, if you want to install it right now, you kind of like need a developer account, uh, but there's another way you can do it and that is actually to uh, get your UDID registered um, at, at a developer uh, and that UDID that's like a unique device identifier code, a unique code that you can find in iTunes uh, on your iPhone 5. There are many tutorials also online how you can find that UDID code. Uh, every iPhone has their own kind of unique device identifier. And, and if you get this code, if you, if you send it um, to a developer, uh, they can actually put that code in into the developer account and then you can find uh, the iOS beta somewhere uh, and you can download it and you can install it and uh, you will not have any problems or you should not have any problems uh, when installing. Now, what's gonna happen if you try to install, you can, you can already try to install the latest iOS 7.1 beta 3 uh, on your iPhone, the specific version. Of course, there's different versions of iOS 7.1 beta 3 available. Uh, for different iPhones, uh, but you need to find like if you're gonna install it on iPhone 5 You need to find the iPhone 5 version of iOS 7.1 beta 3 uh, And if you're going to try to install it without um, uh, Having that UDID code sent to a developer and make them put that into their like developer account You are probably gonna get a problem uh, when you try to install it uh, you, you're probably going to see the text like you're not a part of the Apple developer program. Uh, so just for, for a small amount, um, like a few bucks, uh, you can get this code uh, and uh, um, make it uh, into a developer's account. Uh, and w once you've done that, uh, you should not have any issues installing any of uh, Apple's latest betas as long as the, the, that the code still is in that UDID. So uh, I provide a fiber gig down below. Uh, if you want to get that uh, that code uh, or that UDID uh, into a developer account for just a small amount of money, uh, the, the money they cost to get a full developer account is like 100 bucks. So it's a big, big, big price difference. So you can check it out down below if you want to do that. Um, so then you can get, um, you can see here, I have iOS 1.1 beta 3 here on my iPhone 5. No, I don't. Wow, I'm retarded. Uh, okay, this is my jailbroken iPhone. Okay, so this one is just jailbroken on 7.4, but I have multiple iPhones. So this one is the iPhone 5, and it should provide you with the latest iOS 7.1 beta, yeah, with the brand new um, lock screen here. So what is the cool thing about this, like being able to install beta as well? You can kind of see what Apple is going to do in the future. Uh, and of course, when you have your UDID into a developer account, you can just use the, uh, betas, uh, new iOS 7.1 betas, and download them from somewhere. <laughs> I'm not going to tell you where. Uh, uh, but you can download them and use them uh, like this. And then of course, you can always restore your iPhone back uh, and use the normal iOS 7.0.4 that's well right now, or in the future when new releases is gonna come out, uh, you should not have any issues at all with that. Uh, and uh, so, um, yeah, that's, that's pretty nice. Um, wanna make a quick little video about that, informing people and that is interested in that, how to do it, how to install latest beta. You just need to find it online somewhere, um, uh, the betas. Uh, I'm sure there are <laughs> weird sites that have that in, that, that uh, uh, kind of available, uh, the latest uh, iOS betas should not be able, should not be hard. Uh, but I seriously recommend that you, you also get that UDID code registered uh, because you might get some issues uh, if you if you don't do that. You can you might have you can also get some issues sometimes that uh, you you have to wait uh, or if the if the beta is going to expire if there's a new beta coming out and you don't have your UDID registered. Sometimes you can install it without the UDID, uh, but then when the beta expires, uh, you can't like in install the latest beta and you need to wait for the full version uh, of that iOS version to come out before you can use your iPhone I think so uh, that would kind of suck that would kind of suck that would kind of suck hard uh, I have the iOS 7.1 beta 3 also here on my iPhone 5s so I have a couple of iPhones I like to play around with phones so um, yeah if you want to get it signed um, uh, I have the description down below and hopefully I will see you all in the next video and also if you have any questions you can also probably ask them down below so um, yeah it's a quick little video
Peace out.